Cancer care in Kern County continues to be improved thanks to Houchin Blood Bank and a new machine that is improving the lives of patients and the community. 23 ABC's Amanda Mason joining us tonight in studio with a look at that machine that could help reduce bacteria in donations. Amanda? Well, for cancer patients, platelets are a lifeline, and in order to keep those who receive platelet infusions safe, bacteria and pathogens need to be eliminated from the blood, and this latest technology at Houchin Blood Bank does just that. The Houchin Blood Bank is one of the early adopters of this new technology called the Illuminator, making them one of the only facilities in Kern County to process platelet donations, specifically for cancer patients. Essentially giving us the safest platelet product you can possibly get. In order to create a safe product for those cancer patients, platelets have to go through a complicated process, more than normal platelet donations. A donor spends 45 minutes to two hours giving their platelets. The platelets are then mixed with a solution, and that combination is placed into the Illuminator machine. In just four minutes, the machine deactivates any virus or bacteria that may be in the sample. Before the platelets are sent to the hospital, the solution is removed from the platelets by sitting in a sponge-like material for 12 to 24 hours. It reduces it so the pathogen, any pathogen that might exist in that blood, can't reproduce uh, any longer. So it can't hurt anybody anymore, which again for us is, is critical. Klein says even a small amount of bacteria could be fatal to a cancer patient because they already have a compromised immune system. There's been a couple hospitals in California that have that have had a fatality based on that. And, and for us, that one is just too many. And we made the decision that um, for us, that was just not acceptable. So we brought it here to Kern County. The new process allowing patients to stay at home for their treatment when before they might have had to travel to Los Angeles or further. And most of our blood in, in the inventory uh, goes to cancer. It goes to fight cancer and platelets in particular. And platelets, again, this is our community that is probably the most susceptible for issues issues during transfusion. Um, they're already sick and anything we introduce from any product or any procedure in the hospital could have an adverse effect. Um, and so we'll do everything we can on this side. This prevents a lot of that. This reduces the risk almost to nothing. The difference between red blood cells and platelets are that red blood cells last on the shelf for 42 days, yet platelets only last for five days, which is why the Houchin Blood Bank is looking for more platelet donors. Community needs you. Um, Cancer is not going to stop anytime soon. Um, we're working really hard to, to, to cure cancers and there's a lot of really exciting treatments that are out there, but right now, patients need it. If you know somebody with cancer, there's almost 100% chance they're getting platelets. The new machine may allow more donors to give platelets, even if they've traveled to areas where malaria is common. Houchin Blood Bank is already in need of platelets, and if you are interested in donating, visit our website, turn to 23com for all the details. In studio, Amanda Mason, 23ABC.